All right, welcome back. Um, today we are using GarageBand, and here's our problem. We have now created a song from Loops in GarageBand, and when we try to use it in, let's say, our iMovie HD, it won't work. Well, that's because it's in the wrong file format. There are plenty of different music type of formats. One would happen to be GarageBand, and another one that we use quite a bit is called MP3. You might have an MP3 player. So let's go ahead and figure that out. Here is my song that I've created, and I'll just hit the space bar to let it go here. Well, okay, so I have my song created. I'm ready to go. I'm what ready to use it for my commercial here. I'm going to go up to share. And under share, it says send podcast to disk. Nope, let's say export song to disk. Export song to disk. Well, basically the disk meaning the hard drive, so we're gonna export the song. And luckily at this point, we can change our coder to an MP3 file. And we'll keep it at high quality and hit export. And now it says, well, where do we want it? I'll go commercial song um, and hit save. And it creates that mix down for me. So now it's creating an MP3 formatted song so that I can use it in my commercial. So in just a second, we should be able to find it. My desktop is a little messy here, but let's see if we can find it in a sec. So it's done, okay, and right over here, I have the commercial song, MP3. So if I click on it, it will open up iTunes, and that's fine, you can open it up. I'll agree to that and it will come into iTunes in just a second and I will be able to play Rogers Itemus commercials. There it is. Okay, so now that's an MP3 song. You can just go ahead and take that song and pop it into your iMovie HD so that you can use it on your commercial. Hopefully you learned a little bit about GarageBand and changing files, GarageBand files, to MP3 files. Thanks.